1923, Westmoreland, Jamaica, West Indies. As we celebrate the empowerment of the female by our males in our father's house, there are many mansions. Man, shine. On International Women's Day, the 100th birthday of Arnold Tomlinson, we the strong women, let our voices be heard as we salute. The caliber of the men who have stood beside their women through the trials and tribulations of the systematic discrimination. Without my husband, I would not be here celebrating his 100th birthday with the people from the communities bridging the multi-generational divide to share the stories of a man who left his family, came to the mother country in 1956, the patriarch of the Tomlinson family, we want this celebration to focus not only on honoring the strong women, but in extolling the virtues of the men who help the women to develop our strength. So, age 99 years old, Mr. Tomlinson is ready to defend his, to defend his wife to the end. We need the future generations of the boys who will be the men of the future know what it is to be loyal and live up to the teachings of our ancestors. So when we hear about the fighting spirits of the women who stood beside their men, our man, the whole front, when their men folks are away fighting in the wars, some of which, some of which were man-made, like our four parents were sold into slavery and transported across the Atlantic Ocean. In saluting Nanny of the Maroon, I must make men shine of the mother of creation. Today, I want the women and men to stand beside each other as we show the world why female and male are equal when we empower each other. This is the story of Beverly Myers and Anna Ebenezer Tomlinson, introduced by one of his neighbors in 2001. I am privileged and proud sharing the qualities of my husband. Age is just a number, or the man or woman you see. Happy 100th birthday, Anna Ebenezer Tomlinson. God bless the mothers who gave birth and created nations. Thank you, John!